In this video, you will learn about parts of speech tagging using Spacey library in Python. After tokenization, Spacey can parse and tag a given document. Let's import Spacey. From Spacey, we will import one more library, Displacey, to visualize our POS tagging. I will write from Spacey, import Displacey. And this is used for the visualization. Now I'm going to create an object NLP and in that I will save the English language model. I will write NLP and from Spacey I will call the method load. Inside this I will pass the English language model and the model name is en underscore core underscore web underscore sm. Let's execute our code. Now I'm going to create a variable and save a sentence in that. The variable name is doc. Then I will call this NLP object and inside this I will save one sentence. Let's say I will write Python is a programming language. Current year is 2022 dollar symbol is dollar the reason I took these uh, sentences because it has alphabet number and symbol we will see how spaces part of speech tagging tweet alphabets number and symbol so this will be a good example for us to understand about the POS tagging how it works in the spacey model let's execute our code and let me print this document so here in the output you can see it has this sentence here python is a programming language current year is 2022 dollar symbol is dollar now first we will split this sentence into words that is first we will do the tokenization and then we will apply the part of speech tagging for tokenization we will call the for loop on this document object i will write for token in doc print token and here in the output you can see that these are the token python is a programming language and this full stop is also one token you will see here it is coming in a new row here then the next one is current year is 2022 and the last one is dollar symbol is dollar now we will apply the part of speech tagging and we will see what are the part of speech it has and i will call the for loop again for token in document print token and this will print the token the next will be this one will print the part of speech dot pos underscore and here in the output you can see we got the token and as well as the part of speech let me put one uh, this arrow here so this will help us in better understanding token and part of speech now you can see here so on the left side we have the tokens and on the right side we have the part of speech and you will see here we have different POS such as noun adjective punctuation see the full stop is punctuation then we have noun then this one is SYM is for symbol because this is a symbol here so whenever you see SYM this is symbol then for this number we have NUM number then we have this auxiliary word the noun adjective and so on we have this PROPN so there are many part of speech and if you want to know uh, what the what is the full form of these part of speech so I can also show you that let me show you the full form of these POS these are the full form of the POS. So we have this PROPN. This is proper noun. Then PUNC it is for punctuation. SYMB it is for symbol. ADJ it is for adjective and so on. So these are the full form of the POS tagging that is provided by the spacey. And here you will see we are getting the actual POS tag. Instead of that you can also get the numbers. And for that we will have to do I'll copy this follow from here and paste it here 
and now instead of this underscore we just have to remove it and let me print this so now here you will see instead of this name that is the uh, noun adjective punctuation we are getting the numbers here these are the number and these number in are the uh, this number indicates these pos for example here you will see for noun dollar and symbol these two have these two are noun and let us go here and see dollar and symbol they have they both have the same number 92 and 92 that means noun has this number 92 and so on so if you want to get the numbers then you just have to remove the underscore from this pos but if you want to get the actual name here then you have to put the underscore and now we can also display the result in the form of a chart so we have this here in the form of text here and to display it we will use the uh, library display c i will write display c dot sir and this is the method and inside this we will pass the document so doc in this document we have saved this sentence here you will see in line number four so document and then style and style is going to be DEP let's execute our code and here in the output you will see we got the chart of our part of speech here so here you will see Python it is a proper noun is auxiliary a programming then language then we have current year is dollar symbol is dollar and these these are all the part of speech for our sentence so you can also visualize the pos not only you can print the text but you can also visualize it and this is the best thing about this PC library that here you also get the uh, display, display of or the visualization of your output where you can look at the chart and you can understand it. So this tutorial was about the POS tagging using Spacey in Python. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like my video, you can subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.